Duly noted. July 21st, 2018. Hi, I'm Dr. Kathy Dooley. I'm here with the amazing Dr. Ichin Liu. Hey. One of my favorite physical therapists of all time. Uh, Dr. Uh, Liu and I uh, both teach for immaculate dissection here in Taiwan. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Uh, we're actually lucky enough to have him in New York as well. Um, lucky enough to be able to, to co-teach NKT uh, with him in study groups. And um, Dr. Ichin is able to show you a little bit about what we do in immaculate dissection level four. He's actually painted today uh, we lost a little bit of in his in his uh, neck bending but uh, what's so wonderful is an immaculate dissection what we do is we uh, we cover the different musculature of the suprahyoid infrahyoid region which is a very tough area we see that sternocleidomastoid separates into the posterior triangle here seeing the inferior belly of omohyoid and things like the anterior middle posterior scalenes levator scapula splenius capitis and as and uh, the uh, the trapezius excuse me um, so looking at these relationships and being able to see them move is a wonderful way for you to learn anatomy. Um, for the uh, superhyoid region, the digastrics are seen here, the anterior belly digastric, posterior belly digastric. Uh, you can see how that connects uh, to the mandible here and also to the mastoid notch as we come backwards. Uh, the hyoid is actually a fascial sling where the digastrics attach, helping to coordinate uh, jaw and hyoid movement. You can also see the mylohyoid, which goes from hyoid bone up to jaw to help with the opening of the jaw. And a uh, mastered opposes that by helping to close the jaw. Um, you can also see the infrahyoid muscles that pull the hyoid down. These are coordinated for swallowing. Um, you can see things like, of course, the superior belly of omohyoid, uh, sternohyoid, a little bit of thyrohyoid and sterno uh, sternothyroid. And then um, you can see the inferior belly of omohyoid going out to the shoulder. So seeing these muscles and watching them move in space is a wonderful way to be able to teach it. And, um, and it's really hard to visualize without Danny Cork's amazing artwork. Um, being able to kind of delineate where these things are in space helps you to be able to kind of uh, uh get therapy localization for things like NKT, but also to be able to help you with, um, if you're not NKT or ID, to be able to help you to locate things for your basic treatments, like um, things like active release technique, things like pin and stretch, to be able to know where things are in space is really helpful. Um, we hope that you can take an immaculate dissection course in the future. It's always wonderful to be able to, to find these spots, know where they are, know how things move. And our point in immaculate dissection is always to make you better at what you're already doing. We don't want to replace any techniques that you're doing but make you better at what you're already doing and get you inspired to look at the anatomy deeper we all know anatomy's hard each end anatomy's hard right yes it's hard oh my gosh that's why we commit to making it fun using movement using palpation uh, using corrective strategy and assessment to be able to watch look at this stuff move look how cool this is so being able to watch it move in space and not just look at it in an atlas can be really exciting. And then you have expert instructors like uh, Dr. E. Chen, like Dr. Anna Folkmer and Danny Quirk, uh, being able to help you locate, move, assess. Uh, this is a great way to learn anatomy. We hope you join us soon. You don't have to come to Taiwan. You can actually go on www.immaculatedissection.com or go on our Facebook page, Immaculate Dissection, and see our events calendar where you can sign up. Maybe in New York, maybe in August, maybe in September. Come to a level two or level three with the team, or maybe in a city near you soon. And Dr. E. Chen, we hope you'll be there when they are, are there, because you're an amazing teacher who spent all night getting his neck painted by the amazing Danny Quirk. So hopefully you'll join us soon for an Immaculate Dissection Seminar. We hope to see you soon.